New Makita, brushless motor, T mode. Powerful. It's warm in here. The windows no opening. I'm gonna go drill a hole in my wall. Hello everyone, welcome back. Today we're looking at my little power tool gadget. It's from Makita, it's DTD154. Z cordless impact driver. Now, if you're in America, that's Z. Same thing. You call it Z, we call it Z. Potato, potato. Anyway, so I got this from a company called Fast Fix. I got a package deal. So I got the case with it. It looks like it's straight from a army station. Inside, there's some information leaflets. You get three years guarantee with this. Instruction manual. Tells you about the tools and that. Now when we're gonna buy this, the guy was saying you don't need this because this is one of Makita's powerful tool. But I told him, I said, look, if you were gonna buy a car, would you buy a good one? Or would you buy an average one? He says, well, I'll buy the best one. So I said, well, I'm gonna go for the best one. Especially because they had, they had a deal on. So what I got included was obviously the case, in body itself. I'll show you all these in greater detail. I just thought I'll show you what I got with it. Uh, I got the battery included. I got the special charger. I'll tell you why it's special in a bit. And then I bought some extra bits. Now, let me put the box to the side and then I'll talk you through it all. I thought we'll start off with the battery first, I'll show you the battery. Before I get onto that, I forgot to mention for the whole package, I paid 241 pound 90 new pence from Fastfix. Uh, I ordered it online. Anyway, the battery, this is Makita's 18V lithium ion battery. It's a three amp one. This is, it's got the star sign there, if you can see it. So what that means is this battery, like, with other tools, we've all done this. When we're doing a job and we're drilling, uh, drilling something, and um, the battery's about to die out, but we think, uh, let's get this job finished, let's get it finished. That actually damages your battery. But with these lithium ion batteries, if this thinks that there's less power left in the battery, it automatically shut off. And it's got a little chip in there, so that's the memory. The tool also has a star sign. So they both work in combination with each other. So you don't damage the motor or damage the battery. The battery has a little button there, what you push and you can tell how much power you've got. My bars are full and then obviously as low it gets. The best thing with lithium ion batteries, you don't have to wait for them to go completely flat and then charge them. Like with the old NICAD batteries, if you charge them, like say they were 50% and you charge them, so that would, the battery brain would remember, right? I've, it only be charged at fifty percent, but this one charges really quick, and it gives you twenty-two. Uh, so it charges in twenty-two minutes on the charger. Now let's have a look at the charger. This is the DC eighteen RC charger, and it's got loads of buttons there. So when you put the battery on, it will charge the battery in twenty-two minutes, and the symbol will stay red. Once the battery is charged, it will turn green. This also has a chip, if I can show you. This also has the yellow chip, the star technology. It has four feet at the bottom, four rubber feet at the bottom. So it sits nice and sturdy, it can't move. To insert the battery, you simply click it on. The battery is inserted. To release, push this button and it releases. Now, I said this charger is special. Why this charger is special is this charger has a built in fan in it. So, in often when batteries get really hot, you can't charge them because the charger will accept them because they're really hot. But with this, the beauty of this charger is because with the start technology, you know, thumbs up to Makita for, for doing this. So, you put the battery in, it will cool the battery down and it will charge it at the same time. Excellent. 22 minutes, your battery's done, you're ready to go. This is Makita 
DTD154Z that's the main body the first thing you realize about this the size of it is nice and compact it's flat at the back so you could put your hand on there when you're working and it's really good to get into awkward spaces it's 117 millimeters long and it weighs in at 105 kg it has 175 newton meters of torque a tool this size that, that's powerful well, let's talk about um, where the battery fits first so that has the star sign there so any tool that has a star sign and the battery has the yellow chip on the star sign you, I don't know if you can see the star sign because on the battery it just it's there so they're interchangeable with each other it's a star sign and it comes with a belt clip now the belt clip was pre-installed on the left side but if you want to change it over all you do is take the screw off and you could put it onto the right side here. it says BL motor that basically means it's a brushless motor so it less maintenance in the motor so the motor should last you longer that's what the brushless motor means it has a safety lock on there and then it's two-way rotation system I'll put the battery in and then I could show you when it's working there's a nice slide action choke you slide the choke put the tool in take it off look how quick that is nice and secure one pull and it's off it's got a LED job light so there if I push back in. now that job light would stay on for 10 seconds after you've let go of the trigger but if you don't want that on you can turn that off how you turn that off see the button there so what you do is push it hold that button down a few seconds there it's gone off no more light if you want the light back on simply do the same procedure in reverse there we go the lights back on now that's that and then now the second thing it's a three selection speed and it's got a T mode now they're really banging on about the T mode I'll explain what that is so first of all it's got your slow mode that's for like doing your work around the house then it's got your medium then it's got the high the slow produces 1100 IPM the medium 2600 IPM and the high 3800 IPM that's unbelievable for a machine this size and then the T mode basically it, it's a self drilling system so if you put it in the T mode you're drilling so much so you start rotating really really fast and then when it thinks it's nearly there it'll turn down to the medium grade so that's like 2600 IMPs it'll turn to that so it doesn't over tighten or damage the screw it's got a nice rubber grip nice plastic body this looks like it will really last a long time but Makita tools they always are they've been around for ages and they do do some really nice tools but in team mode that's fast if I was actually drilling somewhere it would slow down and let's take let's so it's got a selector there so every time you wanna if you wanna turn the light off if you wanna push um, change the mode uh, if you don't want to do in T mode if, you, if you're say, working around the house and you want to put in the slow mode medium mode high mode you just push this there some drilling done I know most of you people that uh, know about your power tools and, and things would think that you know I'm showing every little thing putting it on putting it off but there are regular consumers like myself who don't really know much uh, would like to know so to those guys who know their thing and I've just come to see the new Makita tool, the DTD154Z. I apologize for dragging the video on and showing everything. I've taken the light off for the purpose of this video. I'm demonstrating on my door. Um, obviously that's silver so it deflects. I hope you guys appreciate this. If this door falls off, 
Groom Pimana Zade. Anyway, I've got it on the S setting there. So that's a soft one. Set it in reverse. Then click it back for forward rotation. Here we go. Because I, I was tapping this really slowly. So if you tap it, push it all the way, it, it does rotate at a decent speed actually. You know, some that as well. Let, let's have a try uh, uh, a plank of wood outside. I'm drilling a 3 inch wood screw, 75 millimeters, into the wood, and I've set it the cordless impact driver on the T mode. Let's see how it gets on. As you see, it started rotating really fast at the start, and then after that, it slowed down. It was gone in, that's the screw. I will take it back out in the reverse rotation. Excellent piece of kit. Makita DTD154Z OZ, like I said before, if you're American. Brushless motor. Excellent. Absolutely love it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon.